with uh, Yannick and Amy. How are you? Great. Good, good, good. I guess we're all set to go. I want to talk, just to recap for somebody who didn't catch the first segment, uh, the, the jeans are called? House of Halls. House of Halls, and the idea behind them? Is for um, great fit for hard to fit men. So men of stature, usually taller um, or uh, outside the normal size segment. It's hard. It's hard to say normal size because it's I don't true. know about normal size for guys. Yeah, right? I don't every know what guy that exists. Now is hard to fit. Right. Exactly. So um, we were talking about guys with bigger legs or or uh, glutes as well. For athletes would be difficult yeah. to fit into we're jeans. Going in, with the House of Paul's, we go from size 36 to 46 in the waist. Right. 35 is the rise. So for a pretty long leg. It's got a very roomy in the thigh and a really nice, you know, at the waist and at the hip. And you can find these at Lexagon, right? Yeah, and absolutely. That, is it the only spot to find it? Right here? now it's the only spot or online at houseofhalls.com. So think about that. Take a look. Can we bring in our first yeah, model and talk absolutely. about the denim he's wearing? Yeah, so this is a, a local executive and he's um, hard to fit both in height and he's got a larger waist, falls outside of the normal size category. He's wearing okay. a size 42. What's funny is that he doesn't look abnormal to me. No. As a, a person, right? Nope. I mean, it, but there you, are, there you have it. Finding the jeans that are cut for mannequins are, you know, it's, it's going to be difficult for him. He's going to end up with hugely wide legs. Is that what we're looking yeah, at, Yannick? I mean, the, the advantage of having a jean like House of Paul's, a jean that really fits and is made for a bigger guy, mm -hmm. is that he's going to look slimmer. So putting right, everything exactly. on him that's the right size, the jacket is the right size, the jeans are the right size. So as soon as you do that, he actually looks pretty slim. Right. And that's really the illusion that we try to create. So we work a lot with our clients when they come in the store to really find the right people, fit. People underestimate the clothes fitting you. I know that it feels weird to wear something that fits you properly because you're trying to maybe disguise your size. Yeah. But you don't need to do that. No, and if you wear something that's slightly tighter as the fit, right. you know, if, you, if you actually shape the body, you're going to look smaller. Exactly. If you tend to wear oversized clothes to hide something, you're going to just look bigger. And you're going to make yourself look bigger than you actually are. Absolutely. So th what I like about this is the length of the jeans, especially because usually when you find an abnormal size, you've had to go too far too long, yeah. you've had to hem them, which takes the cut right out of yeah. play. And we see a lot of guys, and we'll see it on our, on our next model actually, okay. a lot of guys are rolling their jeans right now. It's it's really coming back into trend. Very cool. And it's nice because there's a lot of detail that we can show when we do that. Thank you very much. All right, uh, our next model, as you were saying, tell me about uh, the type of denim this is, Amy. So this is a salvage denim. It's a, it's a higher end denim. Mm -hmm. um, it's a much stronger, it's a little bit stiffer. Um, and it's got some really nice details. Um, that's why a lot of people do wear it rolled up, as you're going to see there. Yeah, you're yet, almost getting that nice, yeah, that is a nice detail there. It forms really well to the body. Sometimes in the store it feels a little bit stiff, but when you wear it, um, it, it almost molds to your body. And there's some really fun care instructions, you, which Yannick will tell you about. Yeah, you can actually wear this out uh, on the town, right? This yeah. is a dress jean. This is a very dress jean, and it's very on trend right now. It's a darker denim. It's got no sandblasting, no enzyme washing, mm -hmm. nothing. So it's very stiff it's very clean it's got a lot of nice detail on the cuff you can see the salvage which actually stands for self edge okay. which is just a shorter piece of fabric great detail on the pockets love it. It, I do, do love the jean you do have to take good care of it it's a jean we recommend people wash as little as possible gotcha so if you know some guys are used to washing their jeans every time they wear them you should never if you want them to last especially a higher end denim like this mm -hmm. wash it every six months gotcha but you, know? you should actually put it in the in the freezer as a well. a lot of people say put it in the freezer it kills any bacteria or any smell you can febreze it also right just you know because guys tend to wear them so as long as you're not getting it filthy on the outside I don't know you're not, not to wash you're not it. going to the job site with these jeans on no. so you, no. it's not like you know unless I heard someone once tell me unless you spill mustard on a nice denim you probably don't, don't need it. to wash it yeah once every six months, really. Yeah, and Think they about break it. better. They'll fit you better in the long term. Looks too. great with the outfit too. I love Thanks the, the jean and jacket, obviously. He was a size 36, so really, oh, really? it's not just about a, a wider. Also, it's just about tall and and some slimmer guys. Well, as we well. had stuntman Stu down here ta chatting yeah. with you. He's a size 36, but he says he's, he says he's oddly shaped, and he's a normal guy. It's yeah. hard for him to find denim, and here we are, and you're you're servicing right there. Yeah. Who do we have here? Uh, this is uh, also an executive in the area, and he's uh, just a little bit shorter, but also needs a size 38 in the okay. waist but looks really nice this is a, a jean that has a little bit of stretch in it as well nice for going out on the town um, you'd never guess he was a 38 no when you're I know it looks much much never. slimmer okay no, he's just I mean the challenge with Eddie is that he's a little bit wider at the hip okay he's not a big guy doesn't have a big belly he's not right. huge he's got wider hips and usually when they make slimmer jeans they don't make them fit that way gotcha. and so for that one with the black it's got a little stretch in it it's 
incredibly comfortable. Guys put it on and they absolutely so is it comfy? love it. It's comfy? Very comfortable, good. And it's a little bit slimmer in the leg too than the other collars. Right. Black denim tends to tends to cut a little bit slimmer because of the dye in it. It makes the denim much tighter. And you end up seeing people jamming their belt on the waist, right? And you end up getting this pinched feeling and it makes you look bigger yeah. again. So a nice fit. There you have it. I want to thank you very much. I want to bring out all the models out here really quickly and take a look at uh, House of Hall's jeans. You can find it at uh, Lexagon Absolutely. and online, right? Yeah, that's true at houseofhalls.com. Excellent. Guys, check it out.